Students, this is your helpful video for the assignment called Is Earth an Ideal Place? The point of this assignment is to get you going on what we will do often in this class and needs to be done in science. You will make a claim. You've got to have evidence to back it up, solid evidence. But then the reasoning. The reasoning is the thing that will connect the evidence back to the claim, and the reasoning is the graded part of this assignment. All right, so now the claim that you're going to be making will be one of two things. For your claim, you're going to tell me either that humans should use resources to leave Earth and find a place to live elsewhere, or humans should use resources to fix the Earth and we stay here and survive here. It does not matter which one you pick, just pick one and that's what you will write on your document. Now for the evidence for this, I want you to use, I mean, if you're already at home, you need to use the absent version of the file um, <clears throat> because on the absent version, there are sets of the data that you can use um, that we had available in the room, but if you're watching this video, it probably means you're at home. So here's one that we went over in the class. It, you know, the data we give you, what does it mean? I'm not going to go super into what this data means because we did that in class, but as we discussed, the overall trend here is that the earth got warmer um, from about 1880 to looks like 2015. Spoiler alert, it's still getting warmer now. But anyhow, um, so the meaning of this graph is that the earth got warmer. Also, just quick reminder that it came from these four different sources. These are unbiased and are credible sources. Uh, we eliminate the bias by having four of them and that these are all four sources that definitely know about studying climate and temperatures on Earth. So anyway, that was our data from this particular graph. Now, if we go back to this page on the assignment, I'm just going to plug this in. The evidence that supports humans either leaving the planet or fixing the planet is that the Earth got warmer in the last 150 years. The sources of information, those are those four sources with the four different colors of lines on that graph. Um, anyhow, <clears throat> now this is mostly completion when I'm grading it. Now I will just to make sure you didn't put something completely incorrect in there. If you do, I will tell you about it, but just put just the facts. What did that particular graph say? That particular graph said the earth got warmer. Now, how does that connect back to either needing to leave the earth or fixing the earth? And here's the thing, humans. It could serve either point. It can serve either point because why bother pointing out that the earth got warmer and this is not a good thing? Um, the reason, so you could say something like, um, maybe it's too hot or, um, and needs to cool. So like that would be a, a version of why you would say this is evidence if you're going to fix it. Um, or you might say if we're going to, if you're, claim is that we're going to leave it, you might say um, it's too hot and is not ideal to stay or it's not ideal for life. Well, that, mm, although I'm right here saying it's not ideal for life, you would really need a different piece of data to make that particular claim. But if the only thing we have is this one piece of data right here saying the Earth got warmer, well, that's something that needs fixing and or it's a reason that Earth is not so awesome and so let's go. So this one piece of evidence could go either way, either leave or fix, but just make sure you have a reason that connects logically from your evidence to your claim. Now, what you all need to do for the rest of your assignment is look at the other data available to you, come up with 
just the facts version of what the evidence says. Don't forget to list the source. But then the reason is the part that I'm very much going to read. And does your reason make sense as to why, what is the reason that this thing you said here supports your claim up here? That is what you're supposed to do. And then don't forget before you turn it in to make a conclusion, which don't overthink this one. You're basically going to restate your claim with a little bit of the, and now that I've proved my point with the evidence, bam, there it is. All right, submit it when you are done.